We'll start with a mustard heritage, uh, double salmon size 8. I have sheer 40 knot red. So we'll just attach our tine thread at the rear here. Go a wee ways back. Remove that. This is the Kinamalni killer. So once we are there, we'll turn our hook upside down. I have a little short length of silver oval tinsel, which I'll just tack in full length of the body there. So, and then I can go back a few turns and then we just go forward, straighten that up, turn that this way and we'll come up here and we've got one. Two, push that up, three, four, and then in between the hook legs, we turn it back upside down again and lie it at the side of the other tinsel. And we'll tie that off, remove that the same length as the previous tinsel. You can see my tinsel scissors have black tape on them so I don't mistake my good scissors for cutting tinsel. And I can just go there. That's good. We go back. I've got a length of copper wire, which I'll just tack in on the rear side of the hook shank, like so. I have a short length of silver holographic tinsel, which will also just tack in. I'll flatten my tying thread little bit of wax on it and go up to here and then take the holographic tinsel tight into the tag overlap it four turns is enough I come up Tie that off. Tinsel scissors again. Trim that away. And we'll take our wire. Make three. Turns of rib with that. Then we can remove that. Oops. Save it. Okay. Then I have a yellow hackle, which I'll just. Tack in here, move my tying thread out the way, remove that, put a 
sparkle player on it. Make a couple of or three turns here. There we are, perfect. And I'll just reverse my tying thread. I need three hands for this. Just tie off. Hackle. A little bit more wax. I'll tie that hackle down the length of the floss body so we get a nice neat body there. There we are. I'm going to go back now. To there. Excellent. Then I need another short length of the silver wire. And I just want to get that hackle stem positioned correctly in respect to the wire. There we go. I'll just go up here like so and I need a short length of black floss silk just catch it in like that and then I'll make a couple of turns very gently pull it through like so and then I can tie it in and we can take the silk just pull it through your fingers flatten the fibres Got a broken one there, that's okay. And then we can go back. Forward again. And then I can catch that in. Two or three turns, lock it off, remove that, and we can take our silver wire and we can put three turns in on that, come up here. Tie that off, and then with friction, hopefully, remove that. Get that hackle going right. Excellent. Then I've stacked and cleaned a small bunch of yellow and orange bucktail. So we just measure that wing and trim it down. And I can come in here
so. What I like to do, take a drop of super glue just up on that. It gives it a longer life. And I have a length of pearl crystal flash. Just tuck that in there. Like so pull this one over, tie that one down there, and we can trim these off a little longer than the wing. Excellent. I have a very small bunch of black bucktail. This can go a little longer than the yellow and orange wing. And just tack that on top. You can use Arctic Runner or Fox if you want a heavier black wing. Let's trim those off. We come back up here. Then we need a orange hackle. I'll just go back over here. I'll tie that in there. Go forward. do is, I believe, I'll just tie that off, let's reverse my thread. Good, I remove that. Just start at the hook height and work our way back a wee ways. bunch of black bucktail. So I'll just secure on top. Like so. to the front, start at the hook eye. And I have my glue hackle. on that. Fold that back. Make sure you come in front of the orange shackle.
swap that tying thread around the back. Remove your hackle plier. Oops. Hackle, spin my tying thread anti clockwise to flatten it, start at the front, build up a little head. Oops, not want to take those hackles with me. Real whip finish. We can put a put jungle cock on if you like. Remove that. And give the head a drop of varnish. there we have the finished Kilimani Killer Flamethrower. If you enjoy the videos please like, share, subscribe and thank you for watching.